What is going on guys, Tommy H here, and welcome back to another Jurassic World 2 discussion video. Today what we're going to be talking about is the Indominus Rex returning in Jurassic World 2. Now, the Indominus Rex did get pulled into the Mosasaur paddock after that fight with the T-Rex in blue, but some are saying since the Indominus Rex apparently has cuttlefish DNA that it did not die during that scene. I definitely think this is a possibility, but I can't really see the Indominus Rex fitting into Jurassic World 2. Because I, I definitely think they're going to be adding different types of hybrids, and I don't think the Indominus Rex will fit in necessarily with them. And we've already seen the Indominus Rex in Jurassic World, so I definitely don't think it will be in Jurassic World 2, but like I said, it's a possibility. Since the Indominus Rex apparently does have cuttlefish DNA, it could have survived, and maybe when they go back to Isla Nublar to capture the abandoned dinosaurs, maybe the Indominus Rex will be waiting and try to kill them or something like that. And that would be a very interesting scene, and maybe they would have to kill off the Indominus Rex in the very beginning and then they would just create different hybrids from there and another thing is the Indominus Rex initially survived the bite from the Mosasaur so maybe it's stronger than we think it was and maybe ended up getting out of the jaws of the Mosasaur and ended up swimming away like I said because of that cuttlefish DNA and it made an escape and ended up eating the other dinosaurs that were still alive on the island. I know a lot of people want the Indominus Rex in Jurassic World too. I just don't think it's likely that it will return let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you think the Indominus Rex will return in Jurassic World 2? And do you think the cuttlefish DNA that it has saved it from dying in that Mosasaur paddock? And yeah guys, leave a like and have a nice day.